Okay, so I am here I'm going to make my mint smoothie. So I just picked this mint from outside. Um, shout out to Live Well by Kimmy because this is her recipe. I just wrote it down. Um, let's see. Milk, pot, protein powder, chia seeds, bananas, dates, cocoa nibs, spinach is optional, mint, ice, and yogurt is optional. So got the bananas here. I am making some <clears throat> cashew milk. I got two cups of water in here with one tablespoon of cashew butter. That is Kale Junkie's recipe if you follow her on Instagram. Um, so I'm going to blend this up. is just going to go in the fridge. And a little turvis. I love these little turvises. I think they're based out of Florida. Turvis tumblers. So now we've got our mug. Like I was saying before, um, I like to prep it the night before if I'm going to have it for breakfast. Um, because the frozen banana, if you're making it in the morning, takes a minute to thaw out. So if it's made the night before, it's nice and soft in the morning. Um, she said a small handful of mint, but I'm going to put quite a, I'm going to put a lot of mint in just cause it sounds good. So what else is going on with you guys? Anything exciting? I think I'm just going to do one whole thing of this. I'm just picking the leaves off. Throw them in. What I like about smoothies is there's so much nutrients. Like I'm going to grab the spinach out of the freezer. All right, that's quite a bit of mint. I'm going to grab the spinach that I have in the freezer. I know spinach is what her recipe says, but I'm going to use kale instead because we have a ton of kale. Just going to take a chunk. Mush it in there. I tend to add more because definitely need my leafy greens to make you feel better. Okay. I'm adding a lot. I didn't even put a banana in yet, I don't think. Did I? Let's find out. Okay. Pretty sure I put a banana in already. And then we need one teaspoon of chia seeds. These are great for digestion, as you all know. I think I did put a banana in there. Quarter cup of cocoa nibs. I bought this on um, Walmart. I was Pricing around what was the best price. This is a two pound bag. Or no, this is a one and a half pound bag. I think it's organic. But anyway, one quarter cup of this going in. 
And then a scoop of protein powder. I got this from a Clean Eats. Um, it's whey protein, so it's milk-based. I know there's other powders that are plant-based, like pea protein, but this one's pretty good. It's sweet. I like the vanilla and an extra protein. Dates, two dates. So we got two pit of dates here. Throw those in. Protein powder, coconut, mint, ice, and that's it. So I just put the lid on it. Oh, one other thing. I like to put my eggshells in there for joint support because I walk a lot. I'm on my feet a lot. So um, eggshells are good in calcium and for collagen and joint support. So I'm going to get the eggshells. If you follow um, Creative Explained or, you know, you can dry out your eggshells and blend them up. So that's what I did. And it's really great to put these this in a smoothie because um, it stinks, really stinks, but um, you don't really taste it once in a smoothie. It is an eggshell, so you've been warned. Um, and that is it. So I got mint left, which I think I'm going to add this in my water. So, um, yeah, hopefully you guys have a great day. Subscribe. Enjoy. Oh, I was going to check to see if I've got a banana down here. Let's see. I'm going to this. I'll find out in the morning. <laughs> Joke is on me. I want to know though. I'm pretty sure I did. It looks like a banana right there. Let's see. Might have to watch the video. All right, well, you guys enjoy and have a great day. I hope I encourage you to make a smoothie.